Friday afternoon, on-demand storm tracker forecast. Um, Chief Meteorologist Mike Kurt checking with you a little after 1 p.m. We got an interesting pattern with this area of pressure that will follow the jet stream, and this low will be spinning up from the south and west. At the same time, colder Arctic air is going to be diving down into this trough, and that will begin to move in across northern Montana as we look into Saturday evening. So most of Montana, with the exception of the far northwest and southeast, is under a winter storm watch. This will get upgraded this afternoon, so look for updates on our Facebook page on the Storm Tracker Weather mobile app, and of course at 5:30 and 10 at KX11 KBSK. I'm anticipating this winter storm watch to be upgraded for most areas to a winter storm warning, and maybe a few advisories here and there. But significant snow and blowing snow is a strong possibility as we look at the forecast for Saturday evening and throughout the day on Sunday. So let's jump into the finer details. Again, first looking at the timing of the Arctic air because this will really tell us how much snow we could see. If it comes in later, we won't have as much. If it comes in earlier, we'll have more snow than expected. But the timing of it right now is roughly after midnight at about 1 a.m. It's starting to pour down the Rocky Mountain front. And then by early Sunday morning, it's sitting over most of western, central, and southern Montana. So um, this also brings a little problem because we got a lot of warm moisture coming up from the south and west. That means there could be some valley rain mixing with some mountain snow sometime around 10 o'clock Saturday evening. And then that changes abruptly all the snow. So wet roads could flash freeze. We're expecting some pockets of heavy snow and gusty winds. Blowing snow is going to be a huge travel headache uh, for those of you planning to travel Sunday morning into Sunday afternoon. But the storm will taper Sunday night with some partial clearing by early Monday morning. Forecast models varied in their solutions. One model run, they're up. One model run, they're down. I think some of these are inflated. Uh, roughly, I think most valleys will see around four to six inches, and most mountains and passes locally will be picking up a foot plus of snow. But the problem is rain changing to snow. So Butte, rain likely Saturday afternoon. That changes over to snow, and temperatures will be well below freezing as we go into Saturday evening and throughout the day on Sunday. And for Bozeman, the wet weather may not come until after sunset, but rain is likely to change to snow Saturday night into Sunday. And again, moderate to heavy snow likely, and much colder temperatures on your Sunday.